Many with cancer do not know what to eat and what not to eat. In this video, you will understand one biomolecule that helps cancer cells to grow. There are nine amino acids which our body cannot synthesis. Methionine is one of nine essential amino acids. In this research, Three highly malignant cells of three different species, including man, and normal cells are tested for lower methionine in vitro. Normal cells are able to thrive. But cancer cells starts to die. The conclusion was, cancer cells are absolutely methionine dependent. In another research, fresh human tumors of the colon, breast, ovary, prostate, and melanoma were tested for methionine dependency in vitro. Again the conclusion was, methionine dependence may frequently occur in the cancer patient population. Pharmaceutical industries are working on methionine depleting drugs. We desperately need novel treatment strategies for metastatic cancer. Dietary methionine restriction is one such strategy. Methionine is sourced mainly from food. Let's see how much methionine in the various foods we take daily. In fish, it's 583. In chicken, it's 445. In egg, it's 229. In red meat, it's 185. In milk, it's 177. Animal proteins are high in methionine. But plant-based proteins are low in methionine. Choosing low methionine food is the best strategy to starve cancer. Hope you understood that food is medicine, medicine is food. Cancer can be put in remission through diet and nutrition. Have you realized the unseen relationship between the food industry and the health industry?